we uh, make some measurements for a thing called a partial EEG where we're just monitoring brain waves that are kind of specific to sleep and wake so we can tell whether a person's awake or asleep and then when they are asleep what stage of sleep they're in. Uh, from there we put some leads just off to the side of their eyes that help us see if they uh, are going into REM sleep. We can pick up eye movement. We put some, uh, in a case of someone with a beard, along their jawline. Uh, otherwise, if they're clean shaven on their chin, that help us see if a person's gritting or grinding their teeth. Um, from there we'll put some on the chest that monitor EKG to make sure everything's beaten away the way it should. And uh, then we've got a set of belts that wrap around the chest and abdomen. There's a little sensor on each of them that shows us when the chest and stomach move up and down. And that's how we're able to see when a person is making an effort to breathe. And then we have two sensors that go right under their nose that show when air is coming in and out of the nose and mouth. And that's how we're able to catch the air that's actually making its way through the airway. And uh, the last thing, right before they go to bed, we put a little sensor on their finger called a pulse oximeter that monitors the amount of oxygen in their blood. And uh, that's about the extent of it from there. We hook them up and watch them and see what happens.